here. Your vote, that suspicion isn't a crime. We're in, we're in full uniform, Miss Lady. We're not going to go wrong. How do you mean Miss Lady? She uniform? is not in full uniform. She has it on her phone. So her... what? I can get anything on my phone. She has her badge, her name. I don't care. She should have her badge around her neck. Give me oh, oh, name. Oh. Okay, okay. And let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Can I get a supervisor? If I, if I call... Can I dig in my pocket to grab my phone? Sure, you can get your supervisor as well. Okay, no, I want your supervisor. Oh, I don't... Well, can you call one? I don't have one on duty. What are you right now? The blast you. Oh. All right. Give me... I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you. You're gonna get what you gotta get coming. Can I have your name on... Make sure you tell me the right thing. You ain't doing nothing wrong. I know you're not. I'm, I know you. I know you ain't doing nothing wrong, right? I'm not saying you're doing it. Right. You can cancel that. I didn't say you're doing anything wrong, but I want you hey. to identify yourself because you're going in and out okay. of all these buildings. That's all I asked for, okay. right? Huh, grandma. And then he's not in any Hold uniform, on. and she has no badge. Has she badge. has no badge, and she has no badge. Where's but the badge? Sure I'm not looking people, so I'm, at phone. anybody's phones. I want a badge. I Let's want go. a badge. Let's go. I want to go to jail. I want a badge. Because I'm looking... I, I want enter. a badge. I'm, I'm, put me in handcuffs. Let's go. I want a badge. I'm not breaking any law, Miss Lady. I, I stand... I'm trespassing. A, I'm a, I, I, you have to be trespassing to go You're trespassing. trespassing. It's private property. It's you private have property. Trespassing. Trespassing. You have to, to be, be trespassing. trespassing. You're the cop. You, you know the law. You are trespassing. It's private property. We're not trespassing. You have to be you trespassed. Are... Okay, so can we leave? No, we stay. Okay, we can stay. We can stay. So she's. Are we, are we being detained? Two seven seven two to two seven seven. So we are being detained. Are we being detained? I just want your so identification. We're being okay. Are we being detained? Suspicious. Give me your badges. If you can certainly yeah. show a badge to anybody you're here, being you're being hostile. We have it. You're a civil servant. All I did man. was ask you for your okay. identification. So How am I being hostile? Let's, let's, All I you, did I did I ask you for your? You're just. You're protecting and serving. Can you de escalate? You are a civil servant. Give me your Can you please identification of where you people yes, work. Yes, I it. will give you my identification. I, I yes. will you? I okay, but That's before the law for. states, in order for me to identify to a police officer in the state of Pennsylvania, you have to have reasonable, articulable suspicion that I've committed a crime, have committed no, a crime. No, no, no. As long as there's a suspicion. As long as there is a complaint, I have to get to the bottom of the okay, complaint. But correct? Lady, you don't so have, I don't know if anything is we going have an on. I don't we came here for appointments. I, I don't know that. We're telling you. I you came out, you came out. We don't have to give you. Go over there. We don't have to give you. You're not going to talk to me like that, young lady. You're not going to talk to me like that. That's all I asked for. Miss Lady, and I and I will give you. Would you like my lawyer's number? I stand on law, though. Would you like my number? I want my lawyer's number. We can give you our supervisor. Is that what you like? You can contact our supervisor. It sounds like that was doing. Who do you work for? That's all I'm asking. Okay, my name is Jeffrey Dice. I am not speaking to you. I'm talking to you. I'm speaking to you. What are you looking at? You're so hostile, Miss Lady. Don't my face. You want to get mad at me? We recorded it. I don't care. Get mad at me. Give okay. me your identification. Of who you work for? My name is Shasta. Who do you think about? Where about you? You're a police caller, bro. Yeah, we, we do have badges, lady. Something is going on. They don't have badges. We look oh, we are aware. Look who we're wearing. Look who we're wearing. Don't pull it out. We're working. Does she have that on? So, Miss Wait, Miss, Miss Sir, Mr. Sir. That's all right. Sir. Sorry. You put me on YouTube. You going on YouTube. You're going to be famous. <laughs> Y'all with the camera crew. Where the camera crew at? We don't have it over there. Okay. She does not well, have. How about she this? Does not Until have your supervisor be here, I'm going to invoke right my now. Fifth Amendment. Now, if you want to arrest me, you can do that. I'm, I'm sorry you have to go like this. Amendment as well. But for a man that's protecting his rights, you don't need us. Your rights is what? To identify okay. yourself? No, to plead the fifth because I have not committed a crime. I only answer when I commit a crime, Miss Lady. I have not committed a crime. All I'm asking you for is your ID. But I will okay. have to give that if I commit a crime. You're, you're so used to arresting people. Jeez. Okay. Hello, Internet. This is John again here on another episode of uh, Police Interactions. Uh, it's getting interesting uh, day by day. Uh, here we have uh, a lady officer who is uh, uh, approaching uh, uh, innocent citizens in a, in a current manner or in a current behavior so first of all she, she needs to go back to for, for training or refresher on de-escalation of situations rather than escalating situations like this um, her voice the way it's speech the officer looks more um, 
nervous and disoriented than the citizen himself so this is the beauty of always having cameras rolling whenever you have interactions with uh, police who display behaviors like this it's all you'll always be on the safer side when you have, you have your camera rolling because the camera uh, never lies the credit for this uh, video goes to um, someone by the name k brown uh, 369 so this is this is a case of uh, someone called that there is a trespass so this officer is saying that she came there to investigate why this person was there rather than uh, uh, handling the situation in a manner in a calm manner or in a way to de-escalate the, the issue the officer asks for identification there and then from the workers these workers are red, rightfully there they are even wearing the, 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 the uniform for, for work you can, you can identify them from the public and they said they say that they have the ID um, on their phone but this officer who has gone for training on uh, how to de-escalate situations insists that she wants an ID on the neck it sounds crazy but that's what she wants that the ID should be on the neck that is that is being primitive uh, I don't know whether that is um, the right word but I would think she should be more informed than that a badge or an ID can be put anywhere as long as it's visible on the chest not necessarily the neck you can even put on this anywhere as long as it's visible even on your belt not necessarily visible unless if your job description says you should display your ID in a in a specific in a certain manner but the main thing is as long as you have your the ID in person you have the ID in person and you can produce upon request so this worker this innocent um, man here said I have the ID on my phone we can prove that we are we are supposed to be we are legally here but this lady did not want that she wants the ID on the neck the traditional way of having uh, showing your uh, uh, your IDs uh, 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 that is how, how that's how she wants it it's crazy she really needs to go number one to uh, refresh her training to be told that she cannot walk uh, up to innocent uh, people or citizens and uh, uh, act in that manner she was more aggress ag aggressive to the to the to the to the the workers more aggressive to an extent that the workers would not would, would have to be to respond in the manner they did number two this officer is asking for identification meaning she doesn't understand the the, the laws of uh, uh, the jurisdiction uh, she's working because if I check here the laws for uh, where the, the you can see the the, the police uh, uh, the name on the police car there and you can see uh, Pennsylvania um, uh, in Pennsylvania when you are detained on the street by a police officer you do not have to give the police information such as your name address id or immig immigration status however if you choose um, if you choose not to show id or proof provide your name you may be detained for a longer time while police attempt to identify you so it's 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 uh, it's not a mass it's not a mass it's it's not a mass to produce id uh, just upon uh, being uh, stopped by uh, uh, cops unless there is a reasonable and articulable suspicion that uh, they have to identify you 
So in this case, this officer uh, lacks knowledge of exactly the policies which guide the jurisdiction uh, she, she's work, uh, working for. Let's listen uh, once more and uh, as it uh, gets more interesting. Okay, where is it? All right. Give me I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you. You're going to get what you got to get coming. Can I have your name on? Can you? Make sure you're telling the right thing. We ain't doing nothing wrong. I know you're not. I'm, I'm I know you. I know you ain't doing nothing wrong, right? I'm not saying you're doing anything. Right. You can cancel that. I didn't say you're doing huh. anything wrong, but I want you hey. to identify yourself because you're going in and out okay. of all these buildings. I will. That's I'll, all I asked for, okay. right? Okay. Huh, grab my... And then he's not in grab, any of your department. She has no badge. He has a badge. No Miss Lady, but you're making it seem like we're the bad people. So, I'm, hold my phone. Phones. I want a badge. Let's go. Let's I want go. a badge. Let's go. I want to go to jail. Because I'm looking... I, I want answer. a badge. I'm, I'm, put me in here. Yes. Put me on handcuffs. It is always um, very satisfactory. There's some sort of uh, joy when... Uh, when a citizen knows their constitutional rights. It's always so good when a citizen knows their rights. Because in most cases, uh, people's rights, innocent people's rights have been violated just by, by com uh, complying to illegal uh, commands or uh, illegal uh, commands from the officers. Because they are human beings, they are not perfect. They can frame you uh, at times they can make mistake at times so nobody should uh, assume that uh, officers are always uh, 100 percent sure of what they are doing they can be extremely wrong and we have seen cases where people have been jailed for 43 years because of uh, 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 shoddy investigations and uh, uh, reasons of arrest by officers there are people who have been jailed for many, many years, and yet they were innocent. Just destroying someone's life because of your shoddy way of doing uh, of doing your work. This man is very smart. He said, "Take me, he said, take me to jail," and she cannot do it because she has no reason. You cannot walk up to somebody and you just say you are trespassing here and. Uh, you demand an ID very quick. You are not even compose yourself. So this man is smart. He said, take me to jail. Because he knows she cannot do it because she has no reasonable suspicion to do that. Let's go. I want a badge. I'm not breaking any law, Miss Lady. I Actually, stand, you're I'm trespassing. A, I'm a, I, 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 you have to be trespassing. To go you're trespassing. trespassing. It's private property. It's you private have to be property. You have to, to be trespassing. You're the cop. You, you know the law. trespassing. It's private property. We're not trespassing. You have to be you trespassing. Are... Okay, so can we leave? No, we stay. Okay, we can stay. We can stay. So she's are we, are we being detained? Seven seventeen to two So we are being detained. Are we being detained? I just want you. So to My man is is happy to stay longer. He has no problem stays longer because he knows he, he, he he's saying we got this. Let's let's go, let's go. Okay, okay. Are we being suspicious. detained? Give me your badge. If you can certainly okay, show a badge to anybody you're here, you can show me a badge. You are. Civil so all I did was ask you for your okay. identification. So How am I being hostile? Let's, let's, all I asked you, did I? Did I ask you for your, your just you your protect and serve me? Can you deescalate? You, you are a civil servant. Give me your Can you please deescalate? Identification of where you people yes, work. Yes, I yes. will give you my identification. I, I yes. Will you? Question. Okay, but That's before the law for. states, in order for me to identify to a police officer in the state of Pennsylvania, you have to have reasonable, articulable suspicion that I've committed a crime, have committed no, a crime. No, no, no. Yeah. As long as there's a suspicion. As long as there is that statement always annoys the officers especially if they are, you are not sure of what they are doing the moment they realize you know your rights the tone and even the approach they are taking changes the same way when uh, they realize that you are taking a video or or even a witness somewhere on the side is taking a video of the what's happening they always change tune tone and everything even intonation of how they are speaking to you is a complaint, I have to get to the bottom of the okay, complaint, but correct? Lady, you don't so have, I don't know if anything is we going on. We have an appointment. I, I we came here for appointments. I, I don't know that. We're telling you. I you came out. You came Wait, out. You it's a he said. Look, we don't have to give you. Go over there. We Listen, don't have to no, give you. No, you're not going to talk to me like that, young lady. You're not going to talk to me like that. 
That's all I ask for. Miss Lady, and I just I will give you. Would you like my lawyer's number? I still don't law though. Would you like my lumber my lawyer's number? We can give you our supervisor. Is that what you would like? You can contact sounds like that sounds like that was doing. That's all I'm asking. Uh, okay, my name so, is Jeffrey Geist. I will. I am not speaking to you. I'm talking I'm to speaking you. I'm speaking to you. I will be looking Why at you. She's yelling. She's yelling. This is a, a police officer who has been trained on de escalation. She is literally yelling on top of her lungs. And you accept you you expect such a situation to be to be to end well these guys are so smart that they manage to 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 end to manage this situation um, uh, to have a, a good ending because at the end of this video you will see the supervisor uh, uh, will eventually come and uh, uh, will analyze this uh, the situation and confirm that uh, uh, the citizens or the workers are uh, legally there and they are free to continue their work but if you the more you watch this video the more you wonder why this officer is still working in, a, in police so you want to get mad at me we recorded you get mad at me because you get mad at me give me your identification who you work for man that's all I'm asking for me too don't anybody worry about you you're a police caller bro yes we do have badges lady the badge, the badges are there identification is there but this officer wants the badge on the neck that's what she wants she wants the badge on the neck that that's her rules she doesn't want she doesn't want to see the badge on the phone she doesn't want to see the image of the identification on the she wants something else she wants the badge on the neck we're working does she have that on? So, Miss Lady. Miss, Miss Sir. Mr. Sir. That's all right. Sir. I'm sorry. You put me on YouTube. You're going on YouTube. You're about to be famous. <laughs> you're you're going on the camera crew. Where the camera crew at? We don't have it over Okay. She does not well, have... Well, how about she this? Does not until have your supervisor be here, I'm going, in, I'm going to invoke my Fifth Amendment. Now, if you want to arrest me, you can do that. I'm, I'm sorry you have to go like Fifth Amendment as well. But for a man that's protecting his rights, you want me to... Your what? To identify okay. yourself? No. To plead the Fifth because I have not committed a crime. I only answer when I commit a crime, Miss Lady. I have not committed a crime. All I'm asking you for is your ID. But I will okay. have to give that if I commit a crime. You're, You're so used to arresting people. She's saying that What's this she girl saying? is in her building okay. and it's soliciting Doing what? PPL. Oh, soliciting PPL. Her. That's the complaint. Soliciting PPL. Y'all don't, don't even have PPL. Y'all don't even have PPL. You don't even have PPL. You're a liar. You don't have to come over here. You don't have to come over here. Okay. Well, give me your. Do you live here though? I don't answer questions. That about no, I know my law. That's what that lady said. Stop talking. Stop talking. Don't worry about you. Stop talking. Just your identification. Who you work for? That's it. That's all I ask. Okay. I work for IGS. My name is Jeffrey Geist. I'm asking him. Okay. He gave you a phone, and I want to tell you this: you can call me good citizen. Give me your identification for who you work for. Okay. But can I ask you why? I just to verify that you're supposed to be here. Okay. So I'm. So if I have people. So if you want to verify people here, you're supposed to go ask them that we were talking to. No, Kayla, really scary. I don't know. So, that's that's right. Right. How am I scary? I mean, I guess you are, dude. Alright, let's go. Let's go. When I give you my name. When she's nervous thinking that somebody's here maybe doing something wrong, I come and ask you guys questions, and you made it into this big thing. All you had to do was give me your name and who you work with, and then I would have been on my way already. You are law enforcement. That's all that it came down to. You are law, right? I love you. Listen, stop. Let me give you some law. I don't have to identify to okay. you unless okay. I committed a crime. You know this, Miss Lady. I don't know if you did you committed a crime. Okay, well, we did it. Did you committed a crime? Hey, I just No, that lady saying we committed a crime. That is how that's now a citizen schooling a police officer. And you can see that this must must be an officer who was served for uh, many years. Uh just by looking at uh, 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 um, uh, do I say age or how she appears? So you can tell that she has worked for many for uh, quite some time, 
assuming that uh, she uh, she she joined joined uh, the uh, the police uh, 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 early enough or at a younger age so this is somebody who has worked for longer years but she still lacks the knowledge of basic uh, 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 policies and codes of practice uh, for that uh, or generally the basic law Requ uh, requirements when they encounter with the citizens or civilians. And that's what I'm getting to the bottom of. Can so I I'm speak? Well, I'm right. allowed to ask questions. Yes, you are. And we got a right to def deny them. Can I speak real quick? This lady right here, I just spoke with her. You can tell her, Al, she'll tell you everything. Oh, no, I just talked to her about. Yeah, oh, is that a supervisor? Miss Lady, uh, can I just take your name and your name? Oh, no, 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 no. Triple T, actually. <laughs> Now you will see the supervisor now, they, uh, they have arrived, so you will see how they will easily uh, realize that, that uh, their colleague was just uh, messing with uh, uh, this worker's constitutional rights and they will just uh, uh, de-escalate the situation quickly and you, um, you will see how they will do that so quick and uh, leave the innocent uh, workers alone to proceed with their work at least it's always good when uh, some of the officers at least know the, the right thing because in some cases the supervisor will come and the, and again escalate the situation so the citizen will be started there the officer the junior officer and the senior officer or the supervisor are speaking in the same uh, voice and they are all of them are wrong so I'm in that situation it's very dangerous or a slippery path for the for the innocent person because that's where issues of drummed up charges or uh, f uh, fixing uh, people for things they never did that's where and especially if there, there are no cameras it's really sad that's that's why some innocent people end up end up in jail but at least for this instance the supervisor is well versed with the constitution and uh, he will de-escalate this situation in a, in a very short time which is very commendable oh hell we all come, we all come in jail officer 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 Wait, excuse me. I'm so, Wait, excuse me. I'm so, Damn. I'm very happy when Sam live here on your private property. They don't live here anyway. So, officer, we don't live here. Officer, I dealt with you before. You know me. I dealt with you way back there about a year ago. All right, so you trying to rush it. I'm trying to tell you what's going on. All right, so this officer is forcing us to give our name. Well, she don't even care about them. More of me. She wants me to give my name. I've dealt with you before. You know how I operate. So, the only way that I give my name is if you have reasonable, articulable suspicion that I've committed a crime, have committed a crime, or am about to commit a crime. Officer, I'm not committing a crime. Every individual that officer, every individual that we talk to, we have a point today. Now it's like she a big old thing. Yeah, she said that. Nah, the lady said, on you. We got a call. Uh, she said. She said that the lady said that. That we were soliciting that PPL. We, that we were soliciting PPL. They don't even have PPL. They don't even this have whole PPL. Building is is they don't even have PPL. This is the point, though. There was so something guys, going on. That's all. Use, and it would have been much easier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what it what, so what it is? So I'm an independent contractor. So I don't know. I wear what the fuck I want to. So as far as the uniform. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Can I get your names? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. Look at how that supervisor is escalating situation. Very smart. Very smart. And then my sister here will have a walk of shame. <laughs> My name is Jeffrey Guys. So I'm not going to give them It would have been simple just to give me more pride. That's all I want. That's all I ask. I ask everybody for their names. Which is Jeffrey Guys? J-E-F-F-E-R-Y. I know why. G-E-I-S-T? Yeah. Date of birth? 823-94. Now this other person on this side. I don't think it was even necessary for uh, him to give this information 
because he's giving out the date of birth and all that i i, I don't think it's, it's necessary at, at this point if if um uh, the other worker is not supposed to do that then why is this other person here um uh not in the picture but you can um see he's giving out details which i don't think is uh, uh sometimes you do that and you give out your constitutional rights and sometimes you put yourself in problems for nothing i'm not giving mine just i mean it's just go ahead i could probably read it off one year no okay no. what's your name uh macy johnson Oh, 502 You guys from around here? No. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I'm just asking. No, no. We live in the state of Pennsylvania, but we're not from here. We're all from a different state. Where's where there is your um base out of? Like where you do you have an office or anything? Or? You see the way the lady officer is now um, speaking in, in a calm manner. This is what she should have been doing all along. We have officers already. Where's the ground here? I never uh, heard of that before. Can I see? That was. Oh, this is just where I feel Hey, officer. It's late. I still love you. I know. No matter what you say, I still love you. What's the name of the place again? Oh, that you want to work for? We like oh. to work for IGS. So we have to call her. All right, where, where's she go? Oh, she's right there. I call her. All right, go ahead. What's up with you? What's your name and badge number? Because you are officer and you have to identify the police officer. I have to identify the police officer. All right, and what's your name and badge That's number? That's the best thing to do. Always take their name and badge number. Because they have created, they have wasted your time for no good reason. And if you didn't know your rights, they could easily put you in jail for nothing. I actually don't have to do like that. It's part of the policy. I don't know that in my policy. So. Tell me this. No. <laughs> no, wait, 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 wait. You lying. You lying. So you work for a stuff, but you the, you the large deal. So yes. Yeah, but he's counting. According to the... Okay. <laughs> he said, I don't have to get... I love a happy ending like this one. And it could only happen if someone knows their constitutional rights. And I also give this officer, the supervisors, who, the supervisor who, who came, I give um, A plus uh, for doing the right thing and knowing uh, the law. That you're he's not a county sheriff. He's, he's like a like a. Oh, no, you, 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 yeah, he's. Did you get the mirror? Nope. <laughs> Come on, I beat all at this, man. Very, very to the worker who stood for his rights, A plus too. Now, if you're going to add me on so Snapchat, if you're going to add me on Facebook or something like that, I'll be my name, but I'm not so giving you my name. Thing. It would have been, been so much easier. Yeah, but now y'all got us out here like we're the bad people. Nobody's saying that. But we're not the bad people. We're not the bad people. Nobody's Nobody's saying saying that, that. So, so the process is when I get She don't want to call the police. If you were just Police. Okay. Now you're going to have to start all over. Whatever you're going to do. I'm not a different day. Oh, I'm done now. I'm going to go to the bar. I'm going to have a drink. You might see it She said, wait. Listen, I know I get say? the vibe from you. Your 2 a.m. Get my name. Run me through your system. I wasn't running anybody. This lady, come I on, was man. Not, I wasn't running Okay, I do this much. I do this much. I did six and a half years in prison. There's nothing you can tell me. Can I get a, lot? Can I get a cigarette? There's nothing you can tell me about the law. Okay. You can't. Look at me now. Look at the knowledge I give you. I got, I got, I give you so <laughs> yeah, much Because you know I'm right, though. I don't even though. know if I can comprehend it. All right. You might want to be an attorney right. and not a cop. <laughs> right. Because you just How long you been a police? What she did was, it's a scare tactic. She say, <laughs> she's literally asking, how long have you been a police? <laughs> oh my God, she she took a work of shame. Hmm? She took a work yep, of shame. Love it. Love it. I love a happy ending like this. This is really nice. For the lady officer, that was a, a D plus for trying. Because you tried, you tried to, to infringe on uh, innocent uh, individuals' rights. D plus, just for the respect that you have uniform and you have the authority and the respect of the institution. That's all. As to how she conducted herself, that's why 
she gets a D plus. <laughs> okay, so at least the officer knows that next time, in the, in in his in her jurisdiction, there is no stop an ID uh, 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 policy, and she got to learn how to de-escalate situations uh, because she cannot. Um, just to uh, stop people on the basis of uh, of suspicion and just say um uh, i need your 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 identification okay this is uh, the case of uh, who is laughing now <laughs> all right guys see you next time bye bye